Good afternoon, Gruners, or whatever time of day it is, wherever you are in the world. Today is Thursday, the 29th of November, and I thought I'd try something a little different. Welcome to the Donato Daily. Ah! Yes, Gruners, a warm welcome to the first ever Donato Daily. I was out on my run this morning. Yeah, apparently there's a storm Diana here. I didn't even know it had a name. It was just a bit of wind and rain. Yeah, it was coming down pretty good. Um, yeah, so so well that when I uh, got back to uh, my gym, um, I think they thought I was the ghost of Christmas past. The look on their faces when I arrived back was, um, yeah, it was a bit uh, raining, torrential rain and wind. And uh, whilst I was out on that run, I thought, why don't I try something a little bit different? And for those of you who've been following my uh, vlogs, blogs, whatever, the this, this stuff I've been talking about, and I tend to practice what I preach. Um, I'm very much not into um, this new year, new you type baloney. You know, 1st of January, that's when you start new things and this and that. So I thought that's why I'd start this daily vlog today. It's just a day. I mean, I've got to look at it and check what date it is. Yeah, Thursday the 29th of November. So I'm going to hopefully do one of these each day. That's hope, yeah? Who, who knows what will happen? And it will constitute of all sorts of random goodies and things and uh, random odes like, you know, what makes a runner? Whilst I was running out today, I thought, well, with this wind and rain, surely that's one of the things that makes a runner. Leave some comments below what you think makes a runner. So my friends, despite the wind and rain, we still go out and train. That's what makes a runner. And also finishing with a smile. <laughs> oh yeah, see you later guys. But I did have a little ditty and it was along the lines of, despite the wind and rain, we still go out and train. Do you like that? Yeah? So that's one of the things that constitutes a, a runner, I believe. And uh, what, what do you think? Leave some comments below. So I'll be doing some other random ditties and just stuff that I get up to uh, each day. And it'll be posted at different times of the day or night or wherever it may be, whenever you look at this in the world. And it's something where it's just going to be a, a like maybe like a diary uh, or not. Um, <laughs> that I get all sorts of stuff going on so I thought I'd just do some random things and hopefully spread some love and cheer across the world and, and speaking of love I mean who's who's not seen that um, uh, video that's gone viral of love at Christmas when I saw that I, I was just absolutely in tears I might talk about it more tomorrow um, but yeah absolutely amazing I think the guy um, produced and written it and put it on YouTube four years ago um, and only now it's just gone viral. So maybe there's a reason why it's gone viral now. But uh, one of the things that I've been uh, thinking and discussing is that uh, I want to um, do some quotes now and again. If you follow me on the social meds, if you look up on uh, Twitter and Instagram, The Running Guru. So uh, running as in no G at the end and guru. So all one word. I think I'll leave something along there. You can find me at The Running Guru. Um, and I do post quotes now and again, quotes of, of my own. Um, I know lots of people post quotes of um, famous people or those who are dead or whatever, gone and had some famous, famous stuff. But there's one thing I came uh, up with and that was along the lines that So there's a lot of people out there, maybe you're one of these people, the silent majority. Um, who are out there, who have been watching my vlogs each and every time that I post them on there and it helps you and me in some positive way and we can connect in some way out there and I, I do believe out there in this world there's a lot of positivity and a lot of good stuff going on and we just need to connect in some way and maybe this is one way of connecting with you guys. Yes, that's right, you, I'm talking to you. We're coming to a time of year 
where it's all feast and joy and goodwill to all men. But some of us may not be with friends, family or whatever. It's just one of these things that, you know, social pressures maybe make us feel like we've got to go out and celebrate and do this and do that. Why, why follow what the masses are doing or what, what is led to believe that the masses are doing? Why not just be ourselves and be how we want to be and feel comfortable within our own... Uh, within our own skin, within our own selves in terms of what we do. So yes, I certainly out there, I would rather help the uh, silent majority than listen to the vociferous minority. And uh, yeah, there might be some people who do like saying their things and putting up positive things out there. Maybe you could say, this is me being um, you know, a minority that's putting out my word out to you guys. And yeah, but I'd like to feel that it is in a positive way, in some way. So yeah, on that note, I don't know where I edited it. <laughs> if you enjoyed those edits in there of um, my running bit the uh, this morning in that wind and rain, it was just on my iPhone, yeah, on, the, on this little thing. A lot of my video in and vlogs on here have been on the iPhone and I'll be talking about some of the other cameras that I use, like the one that we're looking at uh, right now, which I've done a post earlier, my Canon EOS. M6, what a delightful camera is. Hopefully the sound in this room has come out okay. Let me know what you think about the sound in this room. It's, I've just, it's just a box room in the house that I've just cleared out, put a little desk here, and uh, yeah, a nice little desk. So I might get and do some, uh, you know, so I can work from home properly, <laughs> rather than just off my laptop, on my lap, um, on in the sitting room. So uh, yes, so here, just as a little random fact, in terms of where I am right now, I am in Middle Earth. Yeah, Middle Earth. So for those of you who are Tolkien fans, let me put this phone down before I throw it at the, the camera there. Uh, Middle Earth, yeah, where real Middle Earth is, um, is it Tolkien who wrote the book about the Hobbit and he talks about Middle Earth. He grew up in this neighbourhood here. It's in the Licky Hills, Waisley Hills, so it's South Birmingham area. I'm literally just south of Birmingham. Technically I'm in Worcestershire. So yes, he did write about the shires of um, in that. So it's not New Zealand as the Hollywood people make you say because obviously the director who made the movies was from New Zealand and he chose that. And it's great landscape, beautiful scenery and all that type of stuff. But I'm talking about the actual real Middle Earth, which is right here, right now. So where I'm broadcasting to you from. So right on the footsteps of the Licky Hills, Waisley Hills and the shires of Middle Earth. Maybe I'll talk about more about that on the future daily vlogs. So without me wittering on even more, I think that's it for now. I hope uh, you enjoyed this in some way. I don't know where it's going to go. You might want to challenge me on some things. Leave some comments below what you'd like to challenge me on or what you'd like me to talk about on some of my daily vlogs. It can be running related, non-running related. It could be about anything and everything. Life, universe and everything. When you get to the age that I am, next birthday, 58 yeah. Age is not a number. It's a word. A-G-E. It's a word. Do you get it? Yes. <laughs> so, um... Age is not just a number. So I've been through a lot, I've seen a lot, and a lot of things that I don't share. And again, one of the quotes I put out there is, you know, with our lives that we have, we don't have to share all the good stuff and everything on social media. Some of the best things that we have in life, we don't share on social media. Um, why? You know, we just share it amongst our loved ones. And with it, you know, that's how things people do. It's not have to be everything. We don't have to go blah, 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 all that. But, um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoy this. I'll continue. I don't know how I'll edit this out, what, what has appeared, disappeared in what I've said. And uh, and we'll just keep going on each and every day. I, I don't know how long it'll get. I think I might set myself a challenge of doing this for 30 consecutive days, which means it will encompass through the Christmas period. And we'll see how it goes on from there. But uh, And whether I do keep it up each and every day. Yes, said the actress to the bishop. So, <laughs> I know, uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, um, till next time, I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much for tuning in, and peace out. Bye-bye. I'm going to switch the camera off now. Got to reach forward. <laughs>